My mother-in-law, Franca, recently asked my wife and I what we were doing that Saturday night. I think we were doing laundry. Then she came right out and said it. We were boring. Our whole generation was boring. She's right. In her day, Franca would have been throwing a dinner party or going out to one. I remember my own mother dressed to go out, smelling of perfume and looking gorgeous. As a kid, you don't like that. It's not right somehow. Your mom's not supposed to have a life outside the one slavishly devoted to you. And there's no way she's making you a grilled cheese in that outfit. If any more evidence were needed about the fun they used to have, I have it on film. My dad was something of a suburban auteur with his hand-cranked 8mm Kodak movie camera, so I have footage of one of our street's yearly block parties in the 1960s. Back before cable TV, this is how adults had fun. Then MTV came along, and there was no way a grown-up was going to play musical chairs anymore. Billy Idol was not playing musical chairs in his videos. He was crashing Harley Davidsons through church windows. Now, of course, MTV doesn't know for music videos. Still, Snooki and her Jersey Shore compatriots aren't playing musical chairs either, although it would be interesting to watch. No. Today we prefer to socialize online with our Facebook friends while we watch cable. It's easier. It costs less. No need to dress up. Yep. Thanks to technology, we may be the most boring generation in the history of the planet. Hey, I like that thought. I think I'm going to go and tweet about it.